Hello there, everybody. This is Mario Pivian 13 here, and welcome back to Undertale. We are right here with our hero called Buds. You get to see all about King Buds, and also he is going to kick butt in political debates and everything of the sort. So let's go ahead and see here. Do you smell that? Surprise! It's a butterscotch cinnamon pie. I didn't ask for cinnamon, lady. I'm no, just kidding. But oh well. I thought we might celebrate your arrival. I want you to have a nice time living here. So I will hold up a small pie for tonight. Here, I have another surprise for you. Oh, what is it? Is it cookies? This is it. A room of your own. I hope you like it. Is this a, is something burning? Um, make yourself at home. Okay. Now then, a friend of mine told me that C was used to open up the inventory. Okay, let's go ahead and chat with the cell phone. Okay, I'm here going to say hello. Dialing. This tutorial. You only wanted to say hello? Well then. Hello. I hope that suffices. Hey. <laughs> Click. Okay. We're gonna call her mom. Huh? Did you just call me mom? Well, I suppose. Would you like to make that happy? You to call me mother? Well then, call me whatever you like. Like. Okay. Whoa, okay, this is more very red room. Okay. Can I do something about this lamp? Okay, I can definitely do something about that lamp. What's in here? A box of kids' shoes. A disparity of sizes. What about this? An empty photo frame. It's really dusty. Look at these cool toys. Don't they interest? They don't interest you at all. Um, I guess I should head to sleep. Ah! You found a slice of butterscotch cinnamon pie. Let's see, it's in my inventory. Yes, it is. Don't really want to use the pie. But it's gonna send me pie. All HP. Okay, so it looks like it builds up all HP. But it's got to send me pie in one slice. Okay, good. That would come in handy if I gotta go up against her. Okay, what about in here? I guess definitely see some kind of book over here. This is Toriel's diary. Read the circle passage. Well, this is the end of evading of our privacy, but. Me as well. You read the passage. Why did the skeleton want a friend? Because she was feeling bony? <laughs> the rest of the page is filled with jokes of some similar caliber. Oh, that was a good joke. What about this book? An encyclopedia of subterranean plants. You open to the middle. Type up a group of wetland flowering plant with brown and oblong seed pods, or commonly known as water sausages. Whoa, water sausages? You peek inside. Scandalous! This tutorial sock drawer! You sleep in the bed. Definitely bigger than the twin size bed. Okay, what about this room? Room under renovations. You gotta do some searching. Inside the drawers are flower seeds and some broken crayons. Can I take the crayons? I would like to draw something in the wall. Okay, let's start exploring the freaking the freaking hell out of this place. The books are worn, but they must be read many times. What about the drawer underneath the plant? Inside is an old calendar from the beginning of 2201X. What about this fire poke? Can this be used as a weapon? And that the tools must be filled down to make them safer. It's a history book. There's random pages. Trapped behind the barrier and fearful for the further human attacks, we retreated far, far into the earth. We walked until we reached the cavern's end. 
This was our new home, which we need home. A great as our king is, he is pretty lousy at names. The fire isn't burning hot, but pleasantly warm. You can put your hand inside. Okay, that's pretty creepy, but still cool. Up already? I see. Um, I want you to know how glad I am to have someone here. There is so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite, Bug Hunting Spot. I've also prepared a curriculum for your education. This may come as a surprise to you, but I have always wanted to be a teacher. Actually, perhaps this isn't a very surprising. Still, I am glad you have to have you living here. Oh, and did you want something? Uh, when can I go home? What? This is your home now. Uh, would you like to hear about this book I am reading? This is called 72 Uses for Snails. How about it? Uh, how to exit the ruins? Uh, how about the exciting snail facts? Did you know that snails make terrible shoelaces? Uh, she's trying to evade the question. I have to do something. Stay here. No. She could, she could be up to something. So let's go ahead and start searching. Okay, what about the kitchen? Can I do something about the refrigerator? For some reason, there's a brand there's a brand new chocolate bar in the fridge. Take that chocolate bar, please. There's a white fur stuck in the drain. Okay. Inside the cover, there are cookie cutters for gingerbread monsters. What about the stove? The stove top is very clean. Toriel. Oh, my friend is saying, the mighty pup for us. Okay. You must be knowing that I am playing Undertale. Okay. You must be used to make fire magic instead. Okay. Okay, I, I totally switched every single inch of this floor. Maybe down here? Oh, that just leads up to here. Matter of fact, let's go ahead and save it that way. There you go, but just in case anyway, then I might lose my place. Okay, what's this? Can I, can I touch this light? Okay, I can't touch that light. It looks like I can pull it though. Okay, here we go. Uh-oh. You wish to know how to return home? Do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. One way exit to the rest of the underground. I am going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. Now be a good child and go upstairs. She's insecure about me leaving the ruins. But I will keep on going anyway. Because I am such a good child. Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I have seen it again and again. They come. They leave. They die. The naive child, if you... You naive child, if you wish to leave the ruins, they must... Asgore, they Asgore will kill you. I am only protecting you. Do you understand? To go to your room. The Asgore? Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. You want to leave so badly? Huh. Okay, let's go ahead and try this again. Okay, item? No. How do I want to go back? Okay, um, I can't go back. Can I? Ah, oh, frick. Yeah, I don't really want to use that. Okay, um, how do I want to supposed to go back? Oh, there we go. It was shit. Okay. I would like to act. Tutorial. And we're going to have a conversation. Couldn't think of any conversation topics to have. Oh, frick. Nope, 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 no, 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 no. Oh, good. Tori prepares for a magical attack. Let's talk. Try to we try to think of something to say again, but... Okay, what am I, what am I doing wrong? People, tell me!
Oh! Toriel looks through you! Okay, I talk. Ironically, talking does not seem to be the solution to this conversation. Oh, great, I'm gonna have to fight her! Uh, okay, do I really have to fight her? Uh, we'll try conversation one more time. Okay, that does. I'm going to fight her. Okay. Maybe I fight her and then I talk. Yeah, okay, here we go. We're gonna fight. Toria. Oh, frick, I missed. I'm not sure how to roll. Okay. We're gonna fight you. Ah! Oh. Ah! Oh. Okay, now I can talk? Ah! Oh. Frick! Toriel is acting aloof? What in the world does that mean? Acting aloof. Okay, act. Toriel, we're gonna talk. Yes, she wants me to fight her. me! Prepares for a magical attack! Can I now? Oh, shit. Okay, shit. Prepares for a magical attack. I'm sorry, but I really did try to have a talk, a conversation with you, Toriel. Can I talk to you now? Toriel prepares for a magical attack. Okay. Why in the world do I have to kill this nice lady? I mean, nice goat. Lady thing. Okay. Attack is 80. Defense is 80. Knows what's best for you. Tori looks through at you. Maybe I can act? So we'll talk. Ironically, talking does not seem to be the solution to the situation. Okay, Toriel prepares a magical attack. Okay, I'm sorry Toriel, but I tried to talk to you. Okay, maybe I can acquire to a point that I can give mercy to her? Yeah, I guess that could be it. Okay, I can't do spare because, you know. Okay. Okay, let's go ahead and fight her. Okay. Awesomeness, okay. Tori is acting aloof. What in the frick does that mean? Uh, can I give mercy to her? No, I can't. Okay, what in the world am I missing? Seriously! Oh, okay. Fight. There, can I give mercy to her now? Give her mercy, please! I really do not want her to die! Can I talk to her now? Oh, okay, Toriel is acting aloof. Okay, I'm gonna have to fight you. Come on, please! I would like to spare her! Please! Toriel looks through you. Act. Toriel. Talk. 
Ironically, talking does not seem to be the solution to the problem. Ah. Sorry, I'm a parent for a magical attack. I'm gonna have to fight you. Oh! 294! Ugh! You are stronger than I thought! Listen to me, small one. If you go beyond this door, keep walking as far as you can. Eventually, you will reach a exit. Asgore. Do you not let Asgore take your soul? His plan cannot be allowed to succeed. Dot dot dot. Be good, won't you? My child. Sorry everyone! Sorry everyone, I am really sorry. I'm not sure how the world am I supposed to do that one. Okay, um... I don't know what the frick I just did, but I really did try to talk to her. But... I don't know. Oh, well I saved it beyond, beyond this point. I mean before this point, so... Hopefully everything is going to go right. I did try to talk to her. You all seen that, right? Hey, hey, hey. I hope you like your choice. After all, it's not as if you can go back and change fate. In this world, it's kill or be killed. That old hag thought she could break the rules. She tried so hard to save you humans. But when it came down to it, <laughs> she couldn't even save herself. What an idiot! Okay, what's up, Mr. Creepy Plant? Undertale. Okay. Guessing there was no way to talk out of the situation. I don't know, is it must be from a recent patch or something that I can't even talk to Toriel? I don't know. Or am I missing something? You all go ahead and tell me down in the comment section below. Because I didn't really want to have to kill Toriel, but it seems I just had no choice. Okay, I'm gonna pick up that stick. It's a tough looking branch, it's too heavy to pick up. Oh, okay. Oh. What was that? Uh oh. He's like saying, there is a murderer behind me. You man. Don't you know how to greet a new pal? Turn around. And shake my hand. <laughs> the old whoopee cushion and the hand trick. It's always funny. Yes, it is funny. Man, she kind of reminds me of Patrick. <clears> oh, <throat> it was. You're a human, right? No, man, I'm not good at my Patrick Star impression. That's hilarious. I'm Sans. Oh, a comic Sans. <laughs> I'm actually supposed to be on the watch for humans right now. But, you know, I don't really care about capturing anybody. Now, my brother, Papyrus, he's a human hunting fanatic. Hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. Go right through. My brother made the bars too wide to stop anyone. 
quake behind that conveniently shake lamp. Okay. Yeah, it definitely matches with the guy's shape. Okay, what's up, bro? You know what's up, brother? It's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside of the station. What are you even doing? Jerry really has this left, it's really cool. Do you want to look? No! I don't have time for that! What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready! I will be the one! I must be the one! I will capture a human! Then, I am the great papyrus! Will get all the things I utterly deserve! With that, Rick Pinchin! Yeah, I'm finally able to join the Royal Guard! People will ask to be my... Man. I will be in the shower kisses in this morning. Maybe this lap will help you. Sam, you're not helping me, lazy bone. All you do is sit around and boop doo boo. You get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, I got a ton of work today. A skeleton. <laughs> Uh, come on, you're smiling. I, and I hate that. Sigh. Why does someone as great as me have to do much to get some recognition? Wow, sounds like you're really working yourself. Down to the bone. <laughs> uh, I will attend to my puzzles as we get work a little more backbone into it. Eh. <laughs> Okay, you can come out now. You ought to get going, he might come back. And if he does, you'll have to sit through more of my hilarious jokes. I would love to sit through more of your hilarious jokes. It's some sort of check on a sensory checkpoint, but then there's bottles of ketchup, mustard, and relish sitting inside. Oh, you never see this. Hello, welcome to my show. Today, we, I have an offer on ketchup, mustard, and relish. Would you all like to have some on your hot dogs? Oh yeah, I do not have any hot dogs. Alright, so let's see, what about this? Okay, let's go, let's go ahead and go back. Maybe, actually, hey, hate to bother ya, but can you do me a favor? I was thinking, my brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing you might just make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous. Even if he tries to be. Thanks a million. It'll... I'll be up ahead. Okay, let's go ahead and go back and see if I can get that stick. I really do need, like, some kind of weapon. In case I need to defend myself. Hey, once again, I really did try to talk to Toriel. It's been smashed like it was nothing. Okay. So it seems I can't go back and get that stick as a weapon, so it looks like that our hero is on his own. Okay, we're definitely going to have to find up a safe mark soon, so I can go ahead and take care of this. Mayatoria, you will be missed. Can I carry this lamp? It's just a conveniently shaped lamp. Oh yeah, safe mark. Okay, the convenience of... That lamp still fills you with determination. See? Oh, good. Okay, what's inside the chest? You use the box? Yes. Oh, okay, tough gloves. Okay, press X to exit. Okay, C. Um, item. Tough glove. Use. You equipped tough glove. Okay, good. Okay, what's this up? Okay. Okay, a snow tray flutters forth. Okay. Oh, I'm level 5? Whoa! Okay. Um, I would like to act. Snow tray. I would like to... Um... Choke. You make a bad ice part. <laughs> nice try. Okay, Snow Drake is smiling at its own bad joke. Okay. Okay, can't spare it. 
Okay, we need to act on the snow drink and we're gonna try to laugh. If you laugh at snow drink before you eat, it says anything funny. What are you laughing at? I'm laughing at you! Okay, um, I can act, Snow Drake, and we're going to heckle. To tell the Snow Drake that no one will ever love them the way they are. They struggle to make a retort, then slink away, utterly crushed. Damn! Okay! Okay, that's how I do it! I guess that's how we do it in this game. So we, sometimes we gotta troll people. There I go, just wanna save it for just in case anyway. Okay, let's read the sign. Okay, there's this box. This is a box, you can put an item inside and take it out. The same box will appear later. What? So don't worry about coming back. Sincerely, a box lover. Oh, I love boxes. Okay, let's go ahead and go up here. Oh, fishing pole. This is a fishing rod affixed to the ground. Really, land? Yes. It is attached, let's see, that's all attached to the end is a photo of a weird looking monster. Call me, here's my number. You decide not to call. Okay, I'm gonna call that monster. Torio's phone, dialing. Dot dot dot. No one, but no one came. He sent the line back in. Okay, so it seems there's nothing down that way. So let's go ahead and go over this way. Uh oh. It's the Great Bug Fires. So, as I was saying, you undying. Uh oh. It's a human. Look at that. It's a human. It's a human. Woo! You found, you found your very first human. Sans. OMG. Is that a human? Yes, it is a human! How did you know? Uh, actually, I think that's a rock. Oh. Hey. What's that in front of the rock? Oh my god! Is that a human? Yes. OMG, Sans, I finally did it! I'm dying, Will. I'm gonna be all be so popular, popular, popular! Uh, human, you shall not pass this area. I, the Great Papyrus, will stop you, and then I will capture you. You will be delivered to the capital, and then, then, I'm not sure what's next. In any case, continue only if you dare. <laughs> well, that went well. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep an eye socket out for you. Okay, cool. Let's go ahead and save it again. That way, I can keep my saves up to date and stuff. Okay, let's go. Let's proceed on through. Okay. Okay, I want to use the ice cap. Uh, I would like to compliment you. You informed that it has a great cat. Uh, duh. Who doesn't know? The ice cap makes sure its cat is still there. Can I do mercy? Okay, so it seems it can't be Mercy yet. Okay, act. Ice cap. Okay, and we are going to, um... Steal a hat. We try to steal the ice cap hat. But it does not leak it enough. I knew it! Deep! Uh oh. Okay, the snowy... The, it's snowy... Snow drill. Okay, I can't spare. Okay, act. Compliment. You informed that it has a great hat. My hat is too loud for me to hear you. It's throwing snow drill. Um, okay, can I do a mercy again? Okay, so it seems it can't do mercy. Okay, it's throwing snow drill. Ignore. You managed you managed to tear your eyes away from the snow cap hat. It looks annoying. Hello, my hat's up here. Ah! Snow cap is secretly checking if you're looking at his hat. I need to ignore this guy. Ignore. 
and he continued not looking at the ice cap hat. This seems defeated. A better hatter, hatter than a hater. Uh oh. Ice cap is desperate for your attention. Keep ignoring you. He continue not looking at the ice cap hat. This seems defeated. Fine, I don't care. Ice cap is desperate for your attention. Okay. You won, earning 13 gold. Okay, I definitely need to go ahead and save again. There we go. Now let's go ahead and get going. The Great Papyrus is not waiting for everyone. What's this? Okay, I know what to do on this one now. Okay, act. Snow Drake, and we're going to heckle. You tell the Snow Drake that they aren't... That the Snow Drakes aren't that funny. Is your flesh rotten as you? Okay, Snow Drake is smiling at its own bad jokes. Okay, um, we're going to heckle him again. You tell the Snow Drakes are, that aren't, they aren't funny. This won't be funny either. Okay, Snow Drake is assessing the crown. Okay, I can't scare the Drake. Okay. Um, uh, I'll try to laugh. You can laugh at the third trick before it says anything funny. What are you laughing at? I'm laughing at you. Okay, third trick is smiling at its own bad jokes. Okay. Hack, snow drink, we're gonna haggle. You boo at the snow drink. Is your flesh rotten as you? Snow Drake is smiling at his own bad jokes. Can I actually? No, I can't do. Okay. Act Snow Drake. Uh, we're gonna try to joke. You make a bad ice pun. Ha 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 ha. Nice try. Okay, Snow Drake is practicing his next pun. Echo. You boo at the Snow Drake. You won't be this funny either. Okay, Snow Drake realizes its own pun and is freaking out. Okay, can't do mercy. Heckle. Tell the Snow Drake that aren't that funny. Insults towards humans? Okay, Snow Drake is assessing the crowd. Oh man, this is gonna be a long fight. Laugh. You laugh at the Snow Drake before he says anything funny. What are you laughing at? Okay, it smells like... It smells like a wet pillow. Okay. It smells like a wet pillow. Heckle. Oh yeah, he slicked the white crush. Okay, let's see what's in here. There's some narration on this cardboard box. You observe... Well, you... Well, uh, you observe the well-crafted sentry station. Who could have built this? You ponder. I bet it was very famous, the Royal Guardsman. No, not yet a very famous Guardsman. Okay. What's this? Is this place made to buy stuff? Hey, it's a dog. Hey, what's up? What's up, boy? Need, to get, need, need me to get you a bone? Perhaps even some meat or maybe a steak? Uh, did something move? It was in my imagination. I can only see moving things. If something was moving, for example, a human, I'll make sure it will never move again. A doggo blocks the way. Okay. Act doggo. And we're going to pet the doggo. Doggo is too suspicious of your movement. Don't move an inch. Okay. Okay, act. Okay. Act, doggo. We're gonna pet him again. You pet doggo. What I what I've been pet? Okay, 
Okay. Okay, Doggo has been pet. He won, earning 30 gold. Something pet me, something pet me that is it moving. I'm gonna need some dog treats for this. Someone's been smoking dog treats. Someone's been smoking dog treats. Okay, let's go. What about you? Hey, hey there, there's something important to remember. My brother has a very special attack. If you see it, if you... Okay, if you see a blue attack, don't move, and it won't burn you. Here's an easy way to keep in mind. Imagine a stop sign. When you see, when you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Stop signs are red. So imagine blue signs instead. Simple, right? When fighting, I think blue. When fighting, think about blue stop signs. Okay. Uh, this way? You're so lazy! Nappy all night? I think that's called sleeping. Excuses! Excuses! Oh, the human arrives! In order to stop you, our brother and I have created some puzzles. I think you will find this one quite shocking. What you see? This is the invisible electricity maze. When you touch the walls of this maze, the orbs of this administer a hearty sap. Sounds like fun, because the amount of fun you will have is probably have is actually rather small, I think. Okay, you can go ahead now. The invisible maze. Can I go through it? <laughs> Sans, what did you do? I think the human has has hold the hold the door. Oh, okay. This, please. Okay, try it now. Okay. Incredible! You slippery snail! You solved it so easily. Too easily. However, the next puzzle will not be easy. It is assigned by my brother Sans. <laughs> you will surely be confounded. I know I am. <laughs> hey, thanks. My brother seems to seems like having fun. By the way, did you see that weird outfit he's wearing? We made that a few weeks ago for our costume party. He hasn't worn anything else since. I keep calling it his battle body. Man, isn't my brother cool? I don't understand why they aren't selling. Is the perfect weather or something cold? Oh, a customer. Okay, would you like some nice cream? Yes, I will. It's the frozen treat that warms your heart. Now just a hundred and fifth oh, 15 G, okay. Here we go. Have a super duper day. We got the nice cream. Okay, we're gonna get another one. We're just in case this guy ends up, I mean this papyrus, ends up trying to take me down. Let's do that. Let's just get one more. Yes. There we go, that should do the trick. Okay. Let's just see here. See? We gotta head on over to... Can I get... Dialing. Dot dot dot. Nobody came. Okay. Item. Oh, we got a stick. I need to equip the stick. We threw the stick away, and then it picked, it then picked it back up. Okay. Item. Info. Okay, my ice cream. It, it heals 15 HP. Instead of a joke, the rapper says something nice. Okay, cool. What's this? Okay, what about this? Let's see here. 
I've been thinking about selling treats too. Want some fried snow? 5G. Why not? Did I say 5G? I mean 50G. Um, no. You're right. That's still too low. <laughs> Alright. Where do I need to go? I need to go this way. Uh-oh. It's kitties! Oh yeah, I don't really want to go down that way. Need to go down this way. This way. Let's try this way. Yo man, hope you're ready for... Sans? Where is the puzzle? It's right there, on the ground. Trust me, there's no way they can get past this one. Okay, hey kids, can you help me solve this puzzle? Oh, it's the ice cream wrapper! Uh. Okay... How the world am I supposed to help solve this puzzle? I can't even move! Okay, ball... I can see monster, I just can't... That didn't do anything! Whoops! I knew I should have used today's crossword instead. What? Crossword? I can't believe you said that! In my opinion, Junior Jumble is easily the hardest. What, really, dude? That's an easy-peasy word scramble. That's for our baby bones. Um, unbelievable! Human, solve this dispute! Which is harder, jumble or crossword? Oh, uh, actually, probably crossword, because I can definitely solve this word jumble in no time. But, I want to make sure that I keep this guy happy, so I am probably going to go with jumble. Humans must be very... intellect. Yeah, they, if they also find junior jumble so difficult. <laughs> okay, we totally made that guy happy. Thanks for seeing Junior Jumble, just to appease my brother. Yesterday, he got stumped trying to solve the horoscope. <laughs> oh. oh, look at this. Okay, knowing the mouse might one day find a way, find a way to heat up the spaghetti, feels a bit determination. Oh yeah, there we go. Okay, what's this? It's a note from Papyrus. Human. Please enjoy the spaghetti! Do you, little do you know, the spaghetti is a trap! Designed to entice you! You'll be so busy eating it, that you won't realize that you weren't progressing! Thoroughly gaped again by the great Papyrus! <laughs> papyrus. Well anyways, I hope that you all had a good time! And I think I go ahead and heat up the spaghetti in the background so the mice can go ahead and eat it for me! That's all I know. But anyways, I hope that you all have a good time, and I'll see you all again next time. Take care of yourselves, everyone.